guys and welcome back to both of my channels i don't know which one you're watching it this video from but this video will be downloaded on both my purse fanatic and my fashion fanatic channel if you're just interested in purses and unboxing of purses and things of that nature then the purse fanatic channel is for you so please hit the subscribe button if that is what you're interested in if you're interested in not only purses but up and coming designer items and i do a lot of hauls and things of that nature then fashion fanatic may be the channel for you or maybe both but either way hit the subscribe button for whatever it is you're interested in but today guys i'm so excited i am doing an unboxing of a bottega vignetta bag that i have been wanting for a while and the reason i wanted it is because bottega is known for their green bags and i wanted a green bottega bag because they have that <laughs> The, like vibrant green color that I don't know it's just I love it and I just wanted to have one in that color I don't have any green purses in my designer collection and I knew it would be super to add that in so guys today it is an unboxing of the mini and I don't want to slaughter it but I think it's in or whatever you know what I mean the mini loop bag from Bottega in the color parakeet all right, so I'm also going to, in addition to doing a unboxing, I'm also going to do a what's in my bag, only because if you're gonna purchase this item, you're gonna to want to know that it fits your essential items, the items that you want to be able to put into your purse. You don't wanna get it if you want to absolutely fit your phone in there and you can't fit it. For me, it doesn't matter whether my phone fits or not because I always carry an additional bag with me anyway because I always have a lot of junk. So. Anytime I have a crossbody, I always have a separate bag that I keep as well with me. And um, just to give you an idea of what goes into it. And that way you can make an informed decision about if that's something you're interested in or not. Okay? So without further ado, we'll go ahead and get started. All right. So guys... I was able to get this um, purse for a discount. I did purchase it um, out of the country. I did pay the customs on top of it, but it still came out cheaper than me purchasing it in the U.S. Um, in total, including taxes, it was a thousand. Whereas if I had purchased it um, in the state, I think it's sixteen hundred, and then. I think customs maybe added 150 so it was 1150 versus 1600 and i think that's the 450 dollars saving so i'm super excited i think that's a pretty good um discount of course i don't know you know because i did purchase it out of the country not directly through bottega i'm not going to get all the bells and whistles like the box and i, I don't even know if Bottega comes in the box but um probably won't get that i'll probably get a dust bag but probably not the other things that come with it. I don't know, you know, they probably will give you an envelope or or write you some beautiful message. You won't get that, okay? But to say 450, I don't really mind not having all things. All right, so we'll go ahead and take it out. And we're gonna check it out here. So this is the wrapping from the place that I purchased it from. And Gonna open it up here so it comes in the Bottega Veneta green dust bag all right so I'm excited and of course if you want to stick around afterwards I always model my purses so I will model it so you can see how it looks on all right so again it's wrapped in some amazing paper here So there we go. Isn't that cute, guys? Super cute, super cute. I love the color. Nice color. Nice interweaving, very nice. You can tell this is beautiful leather here. <clears throat> so we're gonna undo it here. All right, and you have the pretty strap. Isn't that pretty, guys? Very pretty. I love, love this color. Isn't that gorgeous? Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I love it. 
okay? So I'm gonna take the tissue paper out. Take a look, see what we get here. I have the Bottega Veneta. I don't know what this is in here. All right, so this is it here. And definitely this is the interweave leather. They say they hand make this themselves. All right, guys, so we're gonna see what we can fit into the purse, okay? So let's see here. So I do have a few things here. Now this is the Samsung phone. It's smaller than the iPhone. I did try to put my iPhone in there and it does fit. You just have to put these phones in at an angle. Now that definitely Samsung, it's gonna go in no problem, but as you, can um or the, as you know the iphone is a little bit bigger so it will get in but it will have to fit in at an angle the other thing is i will always have a wallet with me so i'm gonna try to put that in as well so this is my little coach wallet with my cards um also i have here like a little pouch with change and a perfume and things like that that also fits in here as well okay um i will have to turn it sideways and then maybe like one lipstick so that's the extent kind of what we get in here so not gonna get a lot in this purse okay so right now i have just my credit card wallet my phone a little wallet like a change wallet and a lipstick and that's pretty much that's all we're gonna get into this bad boy okay so it's not the biggest um but again like i said i always carry another purse with me because i do carry a lot of things and usually i like to wear cross bodies when i like to go into a store i don't want to carry too much in so this is perfect you know um so yeah all right, so I'm going to try this on for you. Just give me a second. I'll be back. Hey, guys. So I have on the Bottega Mini Loop, I'm sorry, crossbody purse in parakeet gold. So I thought that I would change my outfit. I do think it's a little bit more of a casual purse. I had on a dressier black dress before, but it really didn't go that well with it. I think it's more casual, like an everyday kind of a purse. So I said, well, let me try it with some blue jeans. And I mean, a blue jean shirt. And I think also it would go with all black, but I think it looks super cute with this outfit I have on. I am going to um, stand up so you can see how it looks a um, long way. I will tell you that it is a crossbody, but it is sort of short. And it could be that I'm tall for a, a, a woman of 5'8. So for me, it's hitting kind of up. I, I like my crossbodies to be a little bit smaller. I don't, this is not really like a an adjustable strap. So you're kind of stuck with whatever the length of it is. I mean, you could try to manipulate the strap, but I don't know if that would be a smart idea. I don't I don't think you can. You might be able to, I'm not sure. I don't, I think it would change the purse, the structure of the purse to unravel things. And I, I don't think I would want to do that. So. Um, I think I'm gonna keep it at the length it is. It's not horribly bad, but I would have preferred it to come a little bit lower than where it's at. Let's see how I look with it on from afar. So as you can see, I really like the pop of green. Um, it really does something to this outfit here, here. So for me, the potato green, I really wanted it. And I thought this would be definitely an affordable option you can go higher they have the baby pouches um those are around i think two thousand dollars the Bottega cassette is like five thousand so i mean you can go higher as far as the cost to get a bigger bag but for me this is suitable um and it's at a lower price point and i just think it does uh, pretty good with um uh with the color, I think it, it really is expressive of that Bottega green that um, that I really wanted in my collection, my first collection. So anyway, guys, other than that, I super love the color. Of course, it's not gonna get a whole bunch 
in it because I showed you you're not going to get a whole lot of things. You probably get your phone in there, a wallet, maybe some lipstick. So don't expect, you know, to put, you know, a huge amount inside the purse. Um, but do know that the leather is very, very supple um, and it's well crafted. The purse is well crafted. So I think it's um, definitely... This is definitely a nicer option if you don't want to go in the in the higher range for, for cost. So guys, if you like this type of videos, purse reviews, unboxings, that type of thing, you like fashion, uh, hauls, up and coming designer uh, reviews on uh, fashionable items, then definitely hit the subscribe button below and we'll notify you of my next up and coming video. And until I see you next time, stay healthy. Take care and peace.